What up, man? This is your boy, Shaka360 from Manos.com, and here we go with the daily offense of today, and today we're going to talk about the Super Custom. I got this Super Custom a lot better. I actually improved it a lot. Even though I haven't updated my Super Custom offense, I'm, I'm thinking and posting, uh, you know, a new update on it uh, that's going to definitely help a lot of you guys, and guess what? This uh, Super Custom is available for everybody to download online, so you can go ahead and go into uh, my PSN and uh and i'm gonna go ahead and, and let you guys download it that's all you gotta do look for my psn and you could download this totally for free and one of the differences is that i i could pass the ball a lot more this time i got a lot more passing plays quick passes uh and i could show you guys my reads against the pass and i already have definitely the best runs in the game on my on my playbook so if i run 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 the ball and then I have some really good money plays uh, that attack through the air to attack through the air. Definitely, that's gonna make me, you know, uh, 150% a lot better. So now here we go. You guys are gonna see here that I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, make my reads. Uh, I see that he doesn't have anybody to the outside here. I motion him just to see what he does, and we're gonna go ahead and lob it up there. But I don't get there in time, and that's an overthrown pass. But in order for you guys to download this custom playbook, make sure you guys like the video and make sure you guys request my PSN uh, where this super custom is at so you guys can go ahead and look for it on Xbox One and on PS4. It's going to be available to download this super custom for free and uh, all you have to know is my PSN. So make sure you ask for it here in the comment section. So here we go. I'm going to go ahead and run uh, the ball over here. It's actually an inside zone. Really tough play to stop. I got the best runs in the game, like I'm telling you guys. And, uh, uh, and the thing that I combined it with some of the best passes in the game. But all you have to do is learn how to read the defense. This guy is running goal line again. Uh, you know, and I'm running into him again. Uh, I, this is just uh, frustrating because I thought there was going to be a challenging, more challenging game. But again, I'm showing you guys, uh, you know, how to run, uh, you know, the perfect offense, man. This super custom play, uh, playbook is just crazy insane. And every year, we create the most insane super custom playbooks. Not only on offense, but on defense as well. Can't wait to show you guys the the defense uh, it's a lot of combination of uh, everything on defense so there's a lot of a gaps b gaps everything uh, edge blitzes uh anything you want to call a blitz it's there so uh here we go we're gonna go ahead and run the ball here real easy inside zone we got beast mode so he's gonna get us a two or three yards and then he likes to push for more yards after uh, you know after they try to stop him so you know he can carry two or three guys on his back and still make a get a first down so here we go first and ten gonna come out in the in the tight actually this is a tight uh counter counter play action counter and we actually uh get uh, only like around five yards we got russell wilson so we could run the ball outside as well i'm using the seahawks the niners win rain rains are super horrible kaepernick can't throw for shit no more so uh i rely a lot on throwing the ball so i think russell wilson is the best quarterback especially you guys want a mobile quarterback uh and that could throw the ball and you know has pretty much decent receivers and a great uh, defense or secondary uh you want to go ahead and stick uh with uh the the seahawks and if you guys want me to post like a depth chart or something let me know here in the comment section as well go ahead and post a depth chart for you guys uh so you guys can know uh how to set up the seahawks uh for to you know to take advantage of their, their defense and offense and everything so as you guys can see here i'm making my reads i'm coming out in play action uh fork and it's a real easy read and as i noticed that he's playing zone so that in the zone against zone against cover three or cover two that middle is going to be wide open and all i have to do is just read the middle linebacker in that case i got the first down and we're going to go ahead and run up the middle right here with a just simple inside zone again i audible to the tight offset and uh, tight end offset and we get the just a quick half back dive right there or inside zone uh play for almost around two or three yards so here we go we're gonna go ahead and come on in strong power nope we're gonna go out of one like what i'm seeing here uh notice that he is in goal line once again and why do people run goal line guys please man you guys suffer because you guys want to suffer don't be running goal line anywhere man and on the field or anything maybe on goal line that's it but don't run it during the game or the 50 yard line guys please don't do that but anyways, uh, here we get another turnover, and we're going to go ahead and, and get the ball back. We're actually in the third quarter now. We're going to go ahead and run it up the gut right here. Just real easy, simple, zero-one trap. 
and I just like to see and test the waters if he's uh, leaving his lineman uh, pretty much open to them down the middle. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take a, you know, and uh, I'm gonna abuse that. I'm gonna do it all day. And if he starts guarding the middle, I'm gonna go ahead and run a counter to the outside. I like to do those reads, you know. What is he doing on defense? Some of you guys don't do reads, man. Some of you guys just go out there and start throwing the ball randomly without reading any linebacker safeties and, uh, you know, the D-line. And look at this right here. Um, I don't know if that happened to you before. Uh, sometimes it happens to me where my lineman is just walking around like an idiot and he goes outside or where my offense, uh, if uh, my offensive center just takes off for no reason and gets a couple of yards. So if that's how it ever happens to me, let me let me know that's, that that ever actually happened to you in a game. Let me know because I know it's been happening a lot lately. So uh, here we go. I'm going to come out in a tight offset uh, counter. And I like to use a counter if everybody's to the inside. Or I like, look at this. I'm using the counter right here. And we got that speed back right there to get the first down. So we're going to go ahead and keep moving the ball. That's what I like to do. Uh, again, counter inside zone are my best two uh, running plays out of this. And I use them a lot. I like to actually abuse, even when they're in goal line formation, man. Um, what is he doing? I don't know what he's doing, man. I'm just going to go ahead and run to the outside. And we get another first down again. So I'm just going to keep abusing it. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and keep uh, doing my thing here. This time I'm going to come out and bunch tight end verticals. Look at this right here, making my reads. Linebackers are high. Guess who's open? Square down below. So you got to make those reads quick. And sometimes people don't send blitzes a lot or you're, you know, this guy's just pretty much sitting back to see, um, I guess, a wait for me to make a mistake or something. But anyways, 0-1 uh, trap, real easy call. Why? Look at the, de the defense alignment. He manages to pinch him, but guess what? He got beast mode right there, man. It's only one yard, so definitely he's going to push for extra yardage. Uh, I wish I had the Niners, man. I and I know you're probably you guys wondering, why are you changing teams to the Seahawks now? Well, the Seahawks are the best team in the game. I'm going to go ahead and work with them. So... Uh, right here we get another touchdown a real easy read right here he was actually in man coverage and right here another turnover and we're back on defense real easy read just gonna come out in a strong power he's i think in, in three four defense or again in goal line i don't know what he's running i think he's on three four d yeah he's in three four d and we're gonna go ahead and come out real quick got one yard late we got martian lynch right here beast mode so he's gonna go ahead and push him in there for a nice touchdown and we get the touchdown so we're gonna go ahead and keep moving the ball and uh, again we're in the fourth quarter now so look at this we're gonna go ahead and run control the clock 28 21 and he could still win this game so we got to control the clock we could choose some clock we could go ahead and uh, i like to choose the clock every once when i know i'm gonna run i choose the clock and then when I'm, i know i'm not gonna run uh, I don't shoot clock, but don't don't do it like that all the time. Like mix it up or do it once or every every uh, every time you get the ball on that on that series. You know, do it once a series. Don't do it all the time. Don't do it to where uh, it, like me. Like I told you right now, I'm gonna run the ball and I'll do it to the clock. Don't do it because people will pick up on those tendencies and they'll notice that and they'll they'll do set up the run stopper and they'll stop it. So make sure. You do it every once in a while, or if you already know you're gonna beat the guy, you're up by two touchdowns or, or you know three, then you can just leave it on the whole time. That's how I use it. So, anyways, here we go, running the ball effectively, chewing some clock, you know, making sure uh, you know we waste a little bit of clock there, and we're ready here. The reason I'm doing this now is because look at this guy coming out in golden. That's horrible, man. Who does this? Who does this to themselves, man? Why play the game and do this to yourself when you can play a better defense or something, man? Anyways, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Hope you guys learned something. If you have any questions, feel free to ask here. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe for more, guys. By the way, we're almost at 33,000 subscribers. And I want to thank you guys for liking the field goal block video and liking the other videos. I hope you guys like this segment or, or series of the daily offensive tips because uh you know this is how i move the ball with my super custom this is the reads i make and uh against uh the, the air against through the air and through through the ground so uh enjoy this video rewind if you guys need any tips on how to run the super custom you guys want to download the super custom hey go ahead and request it here in the comment section and make sure you like the video make sure you are a subscriber all right until there's your boy shock at 60 this game's pretty much over and we're gonna go ahead and just sit on the ball right here and let the time run out and bye guys make sure you guys stay tuned for the defense tomorrow bye down here below for more tips more strategies more schemes more gameplays more tournaments and more 
giveaway prices. Later, it's your boy Shock360. Hit that like button. Don't forget, comment, 